Hi, I'm Susan Garbett, and I have a story to tell. I um, noticed about 10 years ago I had excessive bleeding, uh, more than just the normal from toothbrushing. And then I noticed some of my gums were uh, in, the, in the sink. So uh, I went to my dentist, and he sent me to a specialist, and they did a biopsy, and I found out that I had this mucous membrane pemphigoid. Well, the two first ones I can spell. The second one I couldn't, but uh, I looked it up. I was not happy. It's a, a rare autoimmune disease, and it can affect the mucous membranes of any parts of your body, but usually it's the mouth and the eye. So I lived in Baltimore at the time, and I went to Johns Hopkins, and I had a Johns Hopkins dermatologist and an ophthalmologist who specializes in immunology. Well, thank goodness it didn't affect my eye, but it did affect my mouth. So I went to several different specialists, I got a bunch of different kinds of creams in my mouth and everything like that. Uh, and when I moved to Sarasota, I went to a periodontist who thought that I needed um, um, some gum grafts. And I had seven gum grafts on the bottom of my mouth and uh, he took the skin from my palate, which when I finally uh, was smart enough to get another opinion and meet Dr. Eastman. He said, um, that is the standard protocol for mucous membrane pemphigoid and the shortest MMP. But uh, he would have never taken it from my mouth because that had caused more problems. So I still had the problem and he said, um, we're going to work on that. He watched me closely. He really, really listened. Uh, my Hopkins dermatologist said that it would be good to maybe have a dental uh, plate, um, a dental guard to where the medicine would stay up there instead of me licking it off all the time. It would stay up there 15 minutes, um, maybe twice a day. That would be helpful. Well, Dr. Eastman did make me one of those, and we found out that when you pulled it off, it took the uh, gums with it. Um, so he designed, and I'll show you this, a pliable mouth guard that goes above the gum of the teeth, up to the gums, so that the medicine can stay inside the gum and it can stay up in my mouth for 15 minutes. Well, this little device has changed my life. I wasn't able to eat spicy food. I couldn't stand mint. I used children's strawberry toothpaste. And this thing has changed my life. I had my first, this year, my first hard shell taco and a pick pickle. It was quite exciting for me. I know it sounds bizarre to other people, but my mucous membrane um, Pemphicoid is in remission. I'm so grateful. And I must say that I would recommend Dr. Uh, Eastman. He is a very compassionate, caring man. He really listens. He's an expert in his field. And if one thing doesn't work, he is going to find out what will help you. And um, I would recommend him to anybody. And I have because I gave his name to my dermatologist here in Sarasota. So. She has patients that have pemphigoids and she doesn't know what to do with them. So now we know. Dr. Eastman's your man.